JSA from GOD Gaming and today we're going to do a tutorial on how to take this and turn it into this. Alright guys, well first of all, let's get right into it and get started on how to change the color of your GUI in Elite Dangerous. Now I came across this information while I was trolling around on Twitch one night. I hopped onto a channel and the guy had his GUI set up and it looked really really nice and I asked him how he did it. Uh, so he gave me the Reddit link. Now I'm going to do this with the tools and how it was described in the Reddit link. Uh, so you guys can see it right here. That way if you're a little hesitant on how to do it. Uh, it's really not as hard as one would think. Alright, but without further ado, let's get started. Now, here's a good place. I did not make this. This is not mine. Uh, this is a great little tool that someone has made. And again, all this stuff will be listed in the description. Uh, so, I know what I want. Let's go ahead and crank this on out. And get mine set up how I uh, originally had it. Oh, I'm sorry, 30 there. Now this works in increments of 100. Uh, and the way it was described uh, in the Reddit post made a lot of sense. Uh, so definitely go read that if you guys want a little more in-depth information. Uh, now I'm going to also show a few things that I diddled around with on my own. Uh, you know, at the end of the video so you can get some visual references. And I'm also going to throw up the codes there in front of them so you can see it. But this is my current scheme. Uh, this is what I like. Uh, you guys sit there and do your own. So without further ado, let's go right in here to where the program files are. Now it's going to be one of two places uh, for each person. It may be different. Uh, for the article that was described to me, uh, you know, first place you're going to look in your program files on the frontier under the ED Launcher products. I did not have that. Uh, I found mine here. And I'm going to show you both so you guys know how to do it. Uh, if you find yours in your C drive, go to your C drive. Program Files, x86, go down and find your front to your folder. It seems to be hiding from me. There it is. Go to ED Launcher. Now somewhere in here, you would find the next step in the process, which is your products. I did not. So, I went to Users, to there, now, I've already typed this in a few times, so it's already there in my search. Uh, for you guys, copy and paste works really great. You put that in there. Now, this is what we're looking for. The graphics configurations. Now, I use mine. Open it up with a notepad. Now, I know this looks confusing. Don't pay any attention to that. Uh, this is the only thing we're going to be messing with right here. These three little numbers right here. Now, this is the default orange, so when you open it, that's the default orange. Now, always save or copy, I'm sorry, copy this uh, graphics configuration file and save it somewhere so that if you do mess up, something goes foul, you can always replace it with the original. All right, so since we know our settings down here, you see we've already got it, and it looks just like this up here. So we're going to go ahead and throw those right in there. Run on in there. There you go. Double check, make sure everything's right. You got your commas there. We'll go right back up in here. Save it. Boom. The magic has happened. All right. So let's go ahead and shut everything down here. Minimize that. Now we're gonna take a quick pause and we're gonna open up Elite and see what we've got. Alright folks, uh, we've done our changes to our color scheme there, so let's go ahead and log in. Uh, we're going to check our workout, make sure everything turned out the way you wanted it to. And again, like I said folks, it's not that hard, it's really literally just changing a few number values. And uh, you get uh, a nice new look for your own ship, make it your own. 
Now, if you've enjoyed this tutorial, which uh, I hope it was helpful for you guys, and I hoped it, uh, well, look at, there you go. Look at that, folks. You gotta love that right there. Yeah. I like that. Uh, I think I can work with that for a while, and uh, if you get bored, you can always change it. But yeah, guys, I hope you liked it. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, comment, share it, uh, and guys, if you found it helpful, uh, please help me out. Subscribe right down there. I really appreciate your uh, time, and uh, I'll see you out there.